What? I didn't shake anything up, lady. What is this, vert? Heels with melon. What is up, guys? Welcome back to another skateboarding video game. Today, we'll be playing a Skate 3 competitor, you could say, because this is a game made by Ubisoft after Skate 3 came out, and it is Sean White skateboarding. It's a very, should we just say, unique game. We can do forward flips, which is amazing, and I also think we can do impossibles so that is really cool but the skating itself the animations the physics it's all kind of weird but i mean they tried to go a completely different route than the ea skate games and the tony hawk games they succeeded with that you gotta give them that but uh okay just went into a barrel and we don't really have a free skate mode so that is why you sadly have to watch this hot all the time it's really annoying, I wish you could take that off. But if we take a look at the controls, which are also kind of weird. I also showed them in the last video. But we do a pop shove it by doing a nollie. As you can see, it doesn't really make sense like an EA skate, but I think they kind of took the EA controls and said they were too hardcore, they wanted to make it more mainstream. So they came up with this. So these are all the basic tricks. And if I want to do, for example, this is a barrel flip. And if I want to do a tray flip, then I actually need to do the barrel flip but hold down RT and that is the most weird thing for me and if you want to do nollie tricks you gotta hold down one of the bumpers and if you want to do nose grinds or 5 or so any advanced grinds you're gonna hold down LT so it's really weird controlling this game but I mean let's just focus on the good things we got some forward flips got some impossibles I also showed them off in the last video we did on this game this is actually only my second video on Sean White skateboarding ever oh wow the controls are inverted once once it comes to these so like this okay let's get up there and we made it up here and what are we supposed to do now I also think we have session markers which doesn't work up here if we jump on this rail here where are we supposed to go we're supposed to go up here. Oh, okay. Holding our balance. And. Oh, 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 oh. Way to, th way to shake things up. Wow, we are going slow. Can we actually do a, a real trick? A nose grind? Oh, a roof gap. 540 Where are we going from here? God damn it. Oh And where I don't I don't know where to go uh, Oh Wow, but we were purple there. I think that's the best thing and this spot right here kind of reminds me of something New York ish Just got a laser flip but the tray flip animation, which is something I think is very important in the skateboarding game. It looks so weird in this game. Oh, there's a beautiful man right here. He is gorgeous, but I just want to save my position. What? It's turned off now? That, it just doesn't work. What about here? Saved my position, finally. Let's do a tray flip. Oh, that was a laser flip. Pretty cool too. Let's go back to the session marker. I want to do a tray flip front nose blunt. A little sketchy. Maybe we can do it backside, but up. Oh no, I keep doing laser flips. We can't really power slide in this game, which is weird. I keep doing laser flips, but also this is a small ollie. So yeah, you're flying on, on a quick ollie. Everything is basically on easy mode in this game. Okay, let's try again then. That was sketchy. What? And no, I'm not. I already beat the game. I can't change this area anymore. That was a crook. It's more, more of a nose grind than a crook. But maybe you would count it as an over crook. I actually think I skated here in my last video as well. The verge skating might be a point where people would feel that Ubisoft actually did a better job than EA Skate. What? 
front side 540. Oh, okay, it's because I'm doing the special tricks now. That's a samba flip. Heel flip, late finger flip. Impossible one foot tail. Forward flip, one foot nose. Tray flip, air walk. It said air run. Laser flip, Christ there. Jesus Christ. Literally. 360 hard flip, Benihana. Wow. Okay, and here we have a kicker to kicker with a strong double flip. I guess we can't go this way. Watch out, this is a forbidden area, it's said in my native language. Oh, a switch bigger flip down that. Then let's skate this hover here. Maybe a double flip to a nose grind, to a double heel out, to a grind, to a lip slide. This game is so weird. Oh wow. So is there a way to get out of here? Or maybe we should just skate this king drail. Maybe skate up it. What? I just pressed the A button. And that did a kickflip apparently. Now it did an ollie. This game doesn't really make much sense. But we'll save a session marker here. Do a double flip to a back nose blunt. To a tray flip out. But wait a minute, how did how did I do Nolly stuff? That's on LB. I hold down. Yeah, as soon as I let go of LB, then I'm not in Nolly anymore. Okay, Nolly trays look a little better than the regular ones. Oh, they are disgusting. But what about? Oh, that was a forward flip. We got a Nolly Impossible, let's travel. Watch out, you're in the forbidden area. I just want to travel with the Metro. Rising Island Station, let's try to go here. Manuals require skill and balance. That's why they rock. Vert tri tricking is the key to the, su what? Oh, I remember this place. This was actually my favorite skate spot in the game. I want to find something cool to skate. Wow, let's get some combos of these. Double flip to nose blunt. Oh, that was not a nose blunt. That was not a nose blunt either. And neither was that. Let's try that again. Just a simple front blunt this time. To another front blunt, to another front blunt. There it actually worked. Okay, let's just try a double flip front blunt then. To a double flip to a front blunt again. Sketchy, but okay. Oh man, we are killing it right now. Funny story about this, when I made my other Sean White skateboarding video, Mark, who is one of the leading dudes of Creature Studios making session, he actually told the story about how he quit his job at Ubisoft Montreal because he thought this skateboarding game was just heading in such a terrible direction. So I have mad respect for that as a hardcore skater wanting to make the best skateboarding game out there going and doing his best to make session. It's just fun to hear about how he quit his job because of the story mode of this game. It was also, it was a really weird story but I mean I guess they tried to do something different. Oh yeah I forgot, <laughs> I forgot about the bail animation. Oh, you gotta admit that Sessions Ragdoll, which is set up in a few minutes, is already better than this. Just getting turned into a bunch of balls. So I know Rad Rad, he reviewed this game and he actually did a pretty good job on that. But if you watch any mainstream review channel, you would just see that none of them did any advanced tricks. And all the grinds they did, it was only board slides or 50s. Because to do advanced tricks, you have to hold down LT for the grinds and RT for the flip tricks. Saving position, position saved. All right, I, that was not what I was trying, but we can start out with a 50. Nice, and then we can try to hit this vert wall with a sketchy 360. All right, let's get back up there. Let's try front crook because that should be really difficult. I gotta turn a little bit and then hit LT and up. The spinning is so weird so it's almost impossible not to either not spin or spin all the way over. There we go! 
front crook but as I was saying not to spin all the way over into a no slide and you gotta keep holding LT oh we got that nice and then what do we have here I don't know he just bailed out immediately oh Ollie or whatever I did I don't even know but we made it up here we got another thing to grind should I I should have went way faster or maybe that didn't matter what I didn't shake anything up lady landing into the other skater dude oh yeah switch big flip 5-0 but yeah if you haven't tried this game guys you might want to check it out if you're a skateboarding game fan I know I am and that was why I bought it as soon as it came out I was also like wow a new skateboarding game after skate 3 they gotta at least try to compete with that but I guess they just gave up and went a completely different direction oh what okay that was an invisible wall I'm an artist I'm making a difference you get tired of these people very quickly though I have to warn you about that if you decide to skate if you decide to skate this game <laughs> wow I think we're gonna get one more trick here and then that's it for the video just going in circles but that's because I want to break but nothing is happening position saved let's get a clip here let's get a laser flip 5-0 tray flip nose grind nollie tray flip to what I don't think I can remember all those tricks especially with the weird controls but this is a laser flip to a nose grind to a tray flip to that to a 360 inward heel out okay I guess that was a strong way to end the video I hope you guys enjoyed it and this weird skateboarding game I don't think I'll be playing it more for the channel, but I hope you enjoyed the video anyway. If you did, make sure to leave a like. Also remember to subscribe and of course hit that bell. Then I'll just see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Peace.